just launched at Oroville Lake. I'm headed way off there in the distance, going the other side of the bridge to be here tonight. I decided to come a day early, but late, as I have a busy weekend with other things. So, getting out, sunset, got maybe 40 minutes left. Get where I need to go. A little bit of debris out, but it looks pretty small. Haven't seen anything really big yet, so I'll just keep an eye out. Just uh, moving out. Gonna get in the sun in just a minute. I'm getting past these hills. And we'll get over to Craig Saddle, it's called. My first name, also Craig. And uh, get ready to stay there probably for tonight. This area I stayed last night, there's a tiny sign that is the Craig's um, saddle, they call it, and that's where I did stay. I just came out a little bit into this arm of the lake to uh, get ready with breakfast. Here's my cook stove. I didn't bring a coffee mug, so I have a plastic uh, wine glass, so that is my coffee mug for this trip. But uh, heating up water for my coffee and uh, it's a good morning. It's just a little after 8 a.m. I went by the SS Relief already, right there. Not that you needed to know that, I suppose. First breakfast of the trip. Oh, spam scrambled eggs and my coffee and a wine glass who says I don't have class huh great start
just got my jib set up and part of my mainsail. Uh, just uh, be ready when I get into some breeze. I'm moving uh, up. There's another bridge on this arm of Oroville Lake. I like to go see. Get into an area of debris. There's a bunch coming up there. So I'm going to skirt around way off in the distance. I see that bridge. That's where I'm headed. There's debris out here. some work. I think that's a drainage, but there's also a road that's above that. There uh, is some large debris here. Uh, some of it got snagged up in a five mile an hour zone cone. Went by some large stuff. Uh, some logs are about 30 feet long. This is the bridge that goes over this fork. There are four bridges similar to this, unlike Oroville. 